Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. And today I've got a base review from DE Base Build. These guys are building for activity and they're also partnered with Unfair Warfare and they've partnered with me to give you guys a base that you can use in war. I'm just gonna put a link to their price list there. Uh, as you can see, I think their price is a pretty great value compared to some of the other base building servers. And they are holding guys. These bases are holding. They've got a really good um, guarantee as well on the bases. So make sure you give these guys a quick look and I'll put a link to their server in the description below. Whilst you're down there looking for the uh, server and the base link, just give that uh, grey thumbs up button a nice click, it turns blue. And YouTube tells me that a whopping 72% of you that watch my channel are not subscribed. So let's uh, do, do me a favour, click on that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. Let's dive straight into the action. Right guys, so we've got a couple of replays here to show you from this base. Uh, as I say, it's been built by DE Base Building. And we've got a Yeti attack, which seems to be really, really OP at the moment. As I say, they've, they've sort of come back since the last update, believe it or not. Um, as I say, we've got a Warden Walk starting down at 4 o'clock. Trying to use a Super Wall Break just to open up that wall, but didn't quite work on him. So we've got a Yeti and a King working up from 3 to 12 o'clock. And then down go the Yetis and the Bowlers following behind. So nice funnel created. Rage goes down, Grand Warden ability, Town Hall's down. Okay, we know this is an NT3 star base, so Town Halls are easily accessible, but as I say, it's more about seeing what the back end can do. Can it kill off that army and make sure that you don't give away the three star? So Siege Brax Holds have come out, Royal Champ was following around, working on the Eagle Artillery. And as I say, it's, it's all sort of died out a little bit really. Pekka and a couple of yetis with yeti mites are working their way through the center of the base but you look at that that little compartment there with the scatter shot and the uh, expo is doing some serious work king is also distracting stopping them beat on that wall this is going to slow everything down we've only got an archer and a minion to drop as i say and it looks like that the expo is going to defend the base essentially 90 percent in this meta is pretty pretty good so as I say, same base, we've got a mass minor attack. So this is quite interesting. So uh, looks like it's a Yeti blimp going in rather than the, the customary super wizard blimp that we see so much of. And then Warden Walk, Queen goes down as well. Minion just to help with the funnel there. And then I'm guessing, oh. So wall breaking, freezing that scatter shot before he sends in the miners. Interesting. And mass miners in from this side. Okay, that's a pretty decent funnel. Not the way I would have gone, to be honest, but scatter shot is still up. Queen is working on the lava hound CC. Let's say miners are all working through. Heal goes down, no more spells. So basically that scatter shot remains up. And these miners are going to get really, really quickly. As I say, in this meta, 67%. Strong base. And something that you see quite a lot of, the Blizzard Lalo. Um, I've showcased it on my channel as well. And as I say, going in for this area here, the, the way it is is that, that the invisible spell has to stop one of those main defences as well. It's going to cover up one of those main defences, which is pretty good. Or the CC or something like that. So whilst the value is there, it's, it's awkward. It can, it can get messed up. So Ice Golem and Queen going down. Queen's working on the pups. Ice Golem freezes them up. So it's not looking too bad so far. King has the probability. Luckily, Queen, the our Queen jumps over the wall, so the King was able to make short work of her. And as I say, we are now working our way through Town Hall Activates, Freeze, Hay Spell, Grand Warden Ability, working their way through. But again, it's a backside scatter shot. Gonna need to freeze. Tornado is perfectly placed there. And there's an Ice Hound working his way around as well. Doesn't look like it's gonna pop. But as you can see, the balloons are just getting picked off slowly. And the wizard tower does most of the work. And this is again gonna be 
a fail at 93%. Right guys, thanks for sticking this out this long. Do me a favor, join the D base building server in the description below. Like this video if you liked it, subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell if you haven't already. And watch this video right here on the kitchen supplies. I've hand selected it for you. But you gotta be quick because this video is gonna end in three seconds. Three, two, one. All right, ciao.